Hello everybody, I'm Tom Bresch. This video is a celebration of life for a gentleman that was like a son. He was like a little brother. He was a friend, a great entertainer, and a fabulous guitar player. We lost him in a tragic car accident on February 7th, the night of. So I have put together a video because I have known him since he was 10 years old with his little squeaky voice into the voice of a man and the heart of a saint. I have a bunch of video and I want to put it together so you can learn about my dear, dear friend, Evan Twitty. You know, I was thinking one time, I, I don't do that very much, <laughs> but I, I've been thinking to myself, I was thinking about Jerry Reed, and you know, I said, he did two songs that would have been, if he'd have recorded them together, they just would have been perfect. And that's the claw and guitar man. And so I decided, that I'd make my own arrangement. And so I hope you like it. It's what I came up with. I don't know how much I like it. <laughs> hey, give a hand for Palmer West. <laughs> First guitar I ever bought with my own money. For his young age, he had an array of great guitars. I said to his dad one time, I said, you darn near went broke buying all those guitars. He said, I didn't buy them. He says, Evan worked for them, and he bought them. He played nursing homes. He played uh, old age homes. He played shows. He played whenever he got a chance. Look at some of these wonderful guitars. <laughs> This guitar, I came across it on Reverb.com, uh, Buick, which would be Jerry's granddaughter-in-law, uh, it was given to her by Jerry's wife, Priscilla, and she was deciding to get rid of it, so I went ahead and snagged it up. It's a con. It was Jerry's around-the-house guitar that he picked. Got a cool sound to it.
Look at the pretty one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Evan loved to get a bite to eat. And check this out. Gang, we are at the Waffle House. That's right, you know, Breshman, I love the Waffle House. And I'm here with Evan and his lovely lady, Jenny, and she has never been to a Waffle House because she's from Indiana. They don't have Waffle Houses in Indiana. So she's been wanting, patiently waiting to, for this treat, and all she's having is a waffle, and, uh, and I'm having a waffle and some bacon, and I'll let Evan tell you this extravaganza he's going into. But we're at the Waffle House, wanted to share it with you because it's a virgin experience. And you know how I love any kind of virgin experiences. Okay, here they are. Hello. You feel like it's supposed to feel here? Is, is it different in your mind? Yeah, it's different. I've never been here, so it's, it's a new experience, <laughs> definitely. Mm -hmm. A lot of new experiences when you're with me. Yeah, Oops, I just... sorry. I mean, that to come off here. No, mm -hmm. I am going to have a concoction. This came to me in a dream the other night and I knew I had to live it out. They're gonna put down the waffle and they're gonna just put the omelet on top of it and the waffle will be like a plate. They're gonna take them and they're gonna put on some melted cheese and some Burt's chili. I love Burt's chili. Enjoy. Ah, I intend to. Enjoy. Thank you. a pilgrim and a stranger traveling through this world's home. I've got a home in that yonder city, good Lord, and it's not, not made by hand. He wouldn't quit his hiring, he'd go right on a job and with a 
Now they call him old Delta Dan, the Louisiana Boogie Woogie Man. He does the Louisiana Boogie with a ball and chain. He knows the Boogie Woogie just like his middle name. Stock on that thing looks like a Gretsch. I love Gretsch. Yeah. I love Gretsch too. Joe Carducci, shameless plug. Gretsches are fantastic. Back of the headstock, front of the headstock. The amazing Gretsch guitars. Get the sound only Filtron can give you. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so you can see it.
Sitting on his mammy's knee Picked up a hammer and he jumped And he said, hammer gonna be the death of me Hammer gonna be the death of me John Henry had a little bitty wife Her name was Sally Ann, Molly Ann, Sally Ann <laughs> he got sick and had to go to bed and, and Polly drove that steel like a man Yes, sir Polly drove that steel like a man He comes Eddie Penny a day in his life he spent all his time in the pool hall and he made his living shooting dice lord he made his living shooting dice and then of course you know john henry jr he had a loving little wife she'd kneel with him down on the floor holler joey pick the cotton from the forks of the branch every time john jr rolled a four lord every time to highlight Jerry's great career as a singer, as a songwriter, as a, a musician, as a movie actor, a television star. There just isn't anything this guy put his hand to that he wasn't successful at. But as we talked, we said we also want to point the finger to some of the next generation coming up that have been influenced by Jerry the way we have. So we're going to have some young people on the show tonight that I think are going to really impress you. And we're so grateful that they love this music the way we do. And this next gentleman, come on up here, buddy. Mr. Evan Twitty, make him welcome. And he's going to do uh, one of Jerry's first big hits. And, uh, let me get this up here. Oh, mercy. Well, I'm so grateful to be back here. You know, last year was my first year. And it was such a great thrill and an honor. And, I'm so glad that Sedina and Daryl invited me back again this year to once again screw up a good Jerry Reed song. So, but I get the horns with me on this one. Yeah. One of the old songs he did about falling out he and his daddy had called the Alabama Wild Man. Come on. 
He's 16 years old, folks. Changed all the locks they said they didn't want any of me Cause I'm bad news Something like that. I mean, I'm I'm just uh, taken away by your soul. Can't believe it, but I did it. Open it did. up. There's nothing in it yet. <laughs> it's just empty. I gotta go to the front office to get the diploma. So what you're telling me is you're really not graduated at all. I'm absolutely not. I'm proud of the boy. He did it. <laughs> I'm proud of me too. <laughs> oh, couldn't believe it. Went by too fast. I'll tell you. So proud of him and everything he does. Got to leave cry. So, what graduate were you here for? This is my graduation present that I got just this morning. It's the 1970 what? I don't know, but it's a 1970-something Les Paul recording model. It's got a phaser switch on it, in and out of phase, high and low output, three-way tone switch, of course a pickup selector, two tone knobs, a master volume, and a decade switch that I have no clue what that does, but I'll play it long enough, I'll figure it out. <laughs> That's cool. Congratulations. Thank you. Looking forward to breaking it in. Uh-oh. Let's go to Mason's. That sounds good. I'm hungry. Yeah, we'll, Let's we'll go to some coney. Let's go over and break in our jobs. Oh, good. We can sit over here. I'll have the, the footlong coney. Okay. Just cheese, no onion. Okay. And do you have relish? Yes, we do. With some relish on there. Yeah, would you like it cut in half? Yes. Okay. Uh, I'll have regular sized honey cheese and sauce and a uh, syrup. Congregation makes lots of homemade pies. Wow. 
I just purchased a piece of fudge pecan pie, or pecan if you're from Georgia. It's essentially a brownie yeah, on a crust know. with nuts yeah. in it. Yeah, we better so, mosey on. I just know that's going to do wonders for my cholesterol. Now, do you want a napkin? No, I don't plan on letting any of it miss my mouth. <laughs> Mm. Over here. Uh -huh. Let's try this. Are you guys thinking oh, about some good pie? Mm. Look at all these flavors. The chocolate's going to stay in my mouth all day. Thank you to everybody for watching Brush Digital TV with my graduation ceremony. I'm very honored that you got to celebrate with all of us, and I'm looking forward to what life has in store for me. Thank you very much. One of the greatest thrills Evan ever gave me was a song that he wrote for me about me and playing like me and the whole thing. I said, really? He says, yeah. So I'm going to close this video with him doing a song that I am so honored to have. It's called When the Bresh Man Strikes Again. I hope you've enjoyed this video tribute to my dear, dear departed friend, and I can't wait to see him again someday. Mr. Evan Twitty, with the Bresh Man Strikes Again. Do too much. Just a young kid on the Hank Penny show With a souped up sound like his daddy But a little more chrome Bringing a smile to every boy and girl He got a thumb pick rhythm that'll rock the world A beat in the pocket that's really gonna drive it home It's a live wire concert you can't miss Music row ain't never heard a voice like this Warm as apple pie, sweeter than a jelly roll Well honey, that's him there on Boy, but Jesus and joy in his soul. Oh, you better watch out, baby. Gets a run and he's coming up close when the bass starts thumping. Kicking on a porch board, singing with a big old grin. When the hands start clapping, don't it feel fine? Make you shine brighter than a neon sign. When the string starts strumming, it really gets to pulling you in. And that's how it happens when the British man strikes again.
Thanks, man. BD TV.